Today, I would like to go over how to change the position and format the scale bar in Zeiss Zencore software. Whenever you snap an image in Zencore, a scale bar will automatically be applied to the bottom right corner of your image. If you would like to change the position of the scale bar, simply click on your scale bar. And if you click and hold, you can actually drag this scale bar to a different location anywhere on your image. When you click it, you may notice a two square icons as well as a circle icon. If you hover your mouse over the square icons, what you can actually do is you can resize the scale bar. Again, I'm clicking and I'm dragging. If I click on one of these corners and I rotate my mouse in a clockwise or counterclockwise fashion, what you can see is I can resize or actually change the orientation of my scale bar to vertical or horizontal. Once I'm happy with the location of my scale bar, let's say I want to change the color as well as the formatting. So what I could do here is if I right click the scale bar and I scroll down to format graphical elements, what you'll then see is a format graphical elements window appear. Starting from the top to the bottom, under the line settings, here's all the settings you can change to the line itself. So that's this bar right here. By clicking on this bar, this allows you to change the color. So let's say I wanted to make a green scale bar. This allows you to change the weight, so the size of the scale bar itself. This allows you to change the style of the line and the end caps, either large bar, flat, or arrows. Moving down, here are text options. You can choose to change the style of the font as well as the color. Here's how you change the alignment of the text itself. Finally, down here we have the fill options. So let's say we actually wanted to create uh, a nice white fill in this. This allows to change the color of the fill. If I choose this little drop down menu, the second option will actually apply a fill. So just wrapping up, this is where we can change the color of our line. This is where we can change the weight of the line. Here's where we can change the color of the font. And then finally, here are our fill options. If you would like this to be the default setting for each scale bar, simply click set as new global default. After you close this window, every image will then have the default scale bar with the settings that you chose today. Please note the location of the scale bar will always appear at the bottom right hand corner of your image. And that concludes our session today on formatting the position and the style of our scale bar.